I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is Sunday morning, the 31st of March, 2024, and this is your friend, Angus Bucken, with a thought for the day. It is indeed Resurrection Sunday. He's not dead. He is alive. Today is a day for rejoicing. Friday was a day of weeping. Today is the day of dancing for the Lord. If we look at Romans chapter 8 and verse 11. But if the spirit of him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, he who raised Christ from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies through his spirit who dwells in you. That is incredible news. So the Lord says, my dear friend, if we have the Holy Spirit in us, the same Holy Spirit that raised our Savior from the dead, he had been in the tomb for three days, and he was resurrected on Sunday morning. If that same Spirit dwells in you and I, that same Spirit who raised Jesus from the dead shall quicken our mortal bodies, shall heal us, shall set us free, shall give us new life. I've been there. I've been to that tomb. I want to tell you it is empty. (laughs) There are no bones there. There are no relics there. It is empty. Why? Because he's not there. Because he is alive. He is in heaven. And by the way, he's coming back one of these fine days to take you and I to be with him in glory forever. Jesus Christ is the only God that there is who died for our sins and then was raised from the dead and is alive today. He is there for you and I. Please let us take hold of this incredible miracle and gift which is available to us. Set us free. Give us new life. Heal us physically, mentally, spiritually, and give us an opportunity to start living all over again for Him. God bless you as you enjoy this Resurrection Sunday of victory. Goodbye.